Hello everyone. In this video, I am going to show you why some people's microphone audio does not come through when they are unmuted in a GoToMeeting session. For the person who has put their hand up, been unmuted, and has not been heard, this is a very uncomfortable situation, as it is also an awkward moment during the webinar for the webinar presenter. What I'm about to tell you is going to solve that problem forever. By the way, this problem never comes up for people who have an actual microphone plugged into their microphone input on their computer. This problem arises for those people using USB microphones, such as headset wireless microphones, or microphones built into their webcam, and also for people like me using their line input as their microphone input, since they might be coming through a mixer or a preamplifier into their computer via that line in connection, rather than coming in through the microphone input. Here is the situation. It appears that when GoToMeeting announces that, uh, well, you have been unmuted. The GoToMeeting software attempts to force your recording input to switch to the microphone input. Of course, if you have nothing plugged into your microphone input, there is nothing but silence heard. Here is the solution. Before the webinar begins, we are going to open your recording control. That's the one with the volume controls to record your levels during recording. And we are going to stash that recording control down in our Windows taskbar at the bottom so that we can beat GoToMeeting and switch it back to where it belongs after GoToMeeting has gone and switched it to the microphone input for us. You can get to your audio properties and recording control in either of two ways. Hit your Start button and go to the Control Panel. And it'll take a second to load up. Then double-click Sounds and Audio Devices. And that brings this up. Now, if you want to see the little speaker, by the way, in your taskbar at the bottom, like I have, check this box. OK, um, now click the third tab from the top, Audio. Make sure your sound recording thing here is correct, the right input, and click the volume button. There it is, it's the magic thing. Now just minimize that. You'll notice I have line in selected. It's going to be deselected when I hear the GoToMeeting say you have been unmuted, but we'll get to that in a moment. So minimize that so it's down here. Close that and close your control panels and you're all set. There it is, ready to go. Okay, now let's open up, let's do this again with using the speaker icon. You can uh, right click on that little speaker icon down there and say adjust audio properties. And lo and behold, it brings up the same thing. Click the third tab, click that volume button for sound recording. Minimize that, close that, and you are ready. Okay, now you if you are selected to be unmuted, you are totally ready. As you hear the words from the GoToWebinar software stating, you have been unmuted. Well, instantly restore your recording control from the taskbar where you kept it minimized. You will see the software uncheck that box of the line in or the USB microphone or the webcam microphone and it will attempt to force the selection to the microphone input. Quickly select the correct box again by clicking inside of it and you will be instantly audible once more. That's all there is to it. I hope this has been of a tremendous help for the people who have been facing this frustration, both on the participants end as well as on the webinar presenters end. Actually, I'm pretty sure it certainly will be very helpful.